This dagger is placed upside down. carved from a single branch. The grooves match. A hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. is placed upside down. This symbol is one I've seen carved into shields and headstones. To me, O oh wind. Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Which charm protects from evil spirits? The symbol of the Celtic nut wards off harm. A secure nut indeed. Only one of light need not fear it. Tell me, O oh being of air and light, which is the charm you would use to leave the past behind? The Atome dagger cuts our ties with the past. The upturned blade. Things can be reversed. You know this charm. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? The Skull Souls charm summons voices from Death's realm. In such fashion I speak to druids long dead. But of course you, a spirit, would know that. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to your question. This herb pouch made its way to Gloucester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep, I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuth Lodrin. Kuth Lodrin? <clears throat> very well. I thank you, Halwyn. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Kuth Lodrin. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby.
see you, old friend. Let's see much of that. How far has the search for me stretched? Far enough to say it's best you stick to the countryside and wear that disguise. But Tefter's body has not been found as yet. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Tefter. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Lodren, name of Gwilim, who was drinking with Tefter and myself. Kuth Lodren is the Welsh name for the thieves Warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You did not have to trust me. Tevder's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let's make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. <laughs> This far. Flower Chestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is all. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of Reformation. That's why he was targeted. There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tefter's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch, open to wisdom from the gods. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, we would have heard their horns by now. We are not a humble sort. Blunt tongues and sharp axes. Ludron, the thieves Warren. We're safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then the gods old and new go with you. God's here are vigilant.
always be he gets the dirty jobs.
Aid me. Be my eyes. Oh, shit. Right. Uh, you're a... Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Coonan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sales haunt you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilym. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Coonan for more coin to keep it secret. Why would Kunan pay to have Tefter killed? He is to be his successor. We ain't ones for details. The less we know, the better, yeah? You chose to extort the man, but have no basis for the crime. You're imbeciles. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell him, tell him we've taken care of you. Kunan did this? Why? I've done nothing. To... Oh, God, is he dead? Wake up, wake up. Tell the Dane I've hand fed you like a baby sparrow. Ah, move, fool. Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together. Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Tafter will need to see a healer. This lord have been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Give a good heart. Thank you. When I awoke in this demon lair, I feared the worst. Ow! Ow! Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kunon. He ordered my yeah, death. That's wrong. I don't understand. Ah, He's been like you, a father friend. to me. I will ask him myself. I was spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness, under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces. It matters not. We are all blessed to be alive in his glory. This grave has changed you, Tefta. Changed me. Changed the dressings. I should be cautious around here. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out, but he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? They claimed to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why, only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. 
God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunin. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? I will reveal his sins. Let his people decide if he deserves an honorable death. The man tarnished your name and you would let him live? Shame for shame. Not even his guard will welcome him when I'm done. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modern. And please, take care of Tefta. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. Spotted. The longhouse is a good place to start. your biscuits. Do you give them to your children? I would not let good food go to waste. I would let my children starve. A serpent's gift will always end in malice. Sweet from evil remains sweet, even if it crumbles quickly in their hands. on me. 